So it's my first uh, attendance at a Leon Biopol and I think it was uh, very well attended and the presentations were very good and I think the organisation into sort of material printing, fabrication and then the sort of the second session on the relevance to pharmaceuticals and biotechnology and building tissue models. I think it was a very well organised meeting and the standard of presentations was very good. So they, some of the outcomes is with Organovo previously not having a European presence, um, it was to basically start networking, especially within uh, hubs such as Leon Biopol, so that uh, people know that Organovo really has a European presence, start networking, start working on uh, and establishing relationships with people, being able to really um, network within the 3D bioprinting um, technology space within Europe and in particular Leon Biopol. I think the future of 3D bioprinting in health is very exciting. I think currently what we're seeing is developments such as the uh, our XV liver tissue, where we can really start to see very cellular, scaffold-free tissues being developed that actually have long longevity, so out to six weeks, but before 3D uh, in vitro models didn't really have that longevity. So we start seeing different applications, so uh, uh, chronic uh, toxicity testing. I think also what we're starting to see is the relevance of 3D bioprinting into disease modelling and efficacy of compounds, whereas before it's been really reliant on preclinical sort of species models, which don't always translate very well into humans. So that's an exciting field. And then further afield, I think we're also starting to get grips onto the size of tissues where maybe we need to actually start introducing a vascularization to those tissues. And so we can actually now sort of really start thinking about applying 3D bioprinting into transplantation tissues, or at least bridging patients to transplantation to try and reduce death of people while they're waiting for transplants. I think that's a very exciting feature for 3D bioprinting. I think 3D, um, 3D bioprinting really um, drives and offers better translation models which ultimately helps to give better patient care in the clinic.